What other games, <laughs> like, really do I have a soft spot for? I'm trying to think back. Hmm. Nothing's coming to mind, but I know, I, I know, like, if I look at a list of games I've played in my life, I would be able to pick a few out. But off the top of my head, I'd just say, I guess, Killer7 is probably still number one. I think I've sunk the most time into, as, as far as franchises go, I think Monster Hunter and Pokemon have probably taken up a similar amount of, like, play hours from me. Monster Hunter is, like, really great, but I burn out with it real hard. I always end up skipping one or two, like, major entries into the franchise. Like, I think I played Try for the Wii, and then I didn't play again until the 3DS um, one, which was, like, Monster Hunter 4, I think? Oh, um, what the- Whoa! Whoa! What? Whoa! 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 T-Pose, Joel, this happened- Something like this happened to me in the first game, or uh, when I played the remastered first game. Oh my god, what a start- What an auspicious start to a, the most praised game of the year. Game of the fucking year material right here. What narr what narrative? What immersion? What <laughs> I am at a loss of words right now to explain all my feelings. Cause okay, I'm 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 gonna post to Twitter later today a, a clip of my favorite moment in The Last of Us One, and I am having flash war flashbacks to what happened in The Last of Us One. How? Uh. I, by the way, I've been mashing every button I can press. I've, none, none of them are doing anything. I guess I could pause. Fucking photo mode, bitches. <laughs> yeah. Wait, that's not even Joel. Hold on. Hold on. That's fucking... That's not Joel. I thought that was a copy of Joel. I thought there was two Joels. That's a little bit less funny. Because <laughs> I thought I somehow... Yeah, okay. But it's still it's still pretty ridiculous. I, I don't know what to do about this. Do I have to exit the game? Um... <laughs> I guess we can restart the checkpoint. Is there anything else I should do real quick before... Like... What the fuck did I just do? What was that? What was that? Something popped up. Oh, it's my, um, it's my weapon wheel. Okay. I don't know what button did it. What button did that? Alright, whatever. Nothing's happening. We're gonna restart from checkpoint. Um, chat mentioned Pokemon and Stardew Valley. Uh, Stardew Valley hit me really incorrectly. Like, like that game is on a different wavelength for me because it gave me. This is actually really like weird, but Stardew Valley gave me the worst like anxiety I've ever had from a video game. I, I think Stardew Valley made me feel worse playing like a game. Like I was put into a kind of a foul, dark mood the most from Stardew Valley than any other video game I've ever played. And I think it's something about the daily timer and the way you can approach activities mixed with the fact that it all doesn't matter because, like, the there's no punishment for the yearly system. So I'm, like, constantly anxious in that game to do as much in the day as I can to get my, like, crops going. But then also it all feels like it's for absolutely nothing and it's like this weird existential dread sets in that I don't ever experience from real life, but but experience from video game life, apparently. Um, 
so it's this weird like anxiety based i have to do everything optimally into like it doesn't matter it's this weird surge of emotions that stardew valley kept giving me and i think after i played about uh an in-game month or so i i quit cold turkey and just was like i can't do this to myself anymore uh and then just like like i love fishing in video games it's usually pretty like therapeutic but then there's games like dark cloud which uh fishing is frustrating uh and then there's by the way this loading screen must have glitched out because we've been here forever um i think i think we crashed uh what was i saying oh stardew valley fishing is really stressful and i know i know the more you do it like the easier it'll get but the one thing that would that would kind of calm my nerves a bit in that game potentially uh because i could just fish for away for hours that the one thing that would calm calm my nerves in that game starts out ridiculously difficult and annoying to to finagle um i might have to quit the stream guys because um i think i have to like quit this game and if i quit the game doesn't it quit the stream i guess we'll find out because yeah i'm gonna have to quit it from the menu screen.